Hello and welcome to the channel. I want to be taking you on how to make a drill bit from scratch. So let's go into this video right away. So first of all, for drill bit, uh, let's go with a tempo or uh, BPM or uh, uh, maybe 142, 142. Let's take this to song. Uh, sorry, I'm using uh, FL Studio 20.9. Uh, but i think from uh, uh because most of the features i will be using uh you could easily use them from 20 point um 20.3 20.0 yeah so uh let's go into this video right away so um i'll be using something from saba samples uh and from saba samples i'll be going into um uh the one shots yeah let's use this let's drop our kick our heart first our rim shot our high heart okay all right so let's do this and um for the purpose of this video video i'll be dropping um some uh midi files that i used uh to do this bit uh so let's uh go into it go into it continue with this bit um this is a midi file for kick so i'll be using the midi file for kick yeah this midi file is okay this kick pattern is okay so for the rim let's go into the rim um the rim the rim let me see nah i don't like this let's go with this Now, let's keep searching for the better one. Let's go again, continue, let's keep searching. I like this. Keep searching till we are there. Let's keep searching till we are there. Okay. Okay. I think we're almost there. All right, let me see. Okay, so let's increase this. Okay, this is good. So let's go into high heart. Okay, for the high heart. Let's see. Yeah, this is dope. So for the open heart, I'm going to be doing it manually without a MIDI. Let's do this. Yeah. Okay. So let's go into our, uh, let's go into our, uh, uh, 
our sound right now let's go into the melody and for the melody uh, i'm going to be searching on uh nexus i'm going to be using nexus for this let's go into single layer parts let's check i need something weird So let's go into making it properly. Okay, let's go. Okay with this. Um, okay. thing we're going to be doing let's go into um uh, 808 for the 808 uh I've, I've i've got a bunch of 808s i use so let me use a jcap to style 808 let's expand it this way so we're going to be using the root note for everything so let me show you how to get rid of uh the lousy you know long long sounds in 808 so you kill the attack 
and they sustain you can see how I make it let's go so this here slide it okay so let's play with the 808 around here we're gonna be doing let's go into Lexus again and for this I'm gonna be using um the plot for the plot uh, let's check let's spread it so it could be spanning from left to right and for this let's use the root note okay first of all let's cut this 808 Take it to its original playlist. For this, let's use the root note. So let's cut it, bring it back to its original playlist, drop it here. Yeah, 
so um let's add something uh let's use virgin choir for this for the virgin choir let's go into it let's expand it let's go back to our main point let's use the root note and for this let's make sure this is Okay, kind of. So let's go. This. playlist okay so finally let's do something um i think uh, let's use expand add in expand uh what we're going to be doing is let's use um the hot lead the square stock whoa let's check out this let's use the root note again for this bit today but um let's get something right for the purpose of this video i want to add something uh go get this you need to go get this you need to go get this some of these plugins 
So, I want to add something for the purpose of clarity on this video, on this tutorial. Let's go into Ozone 9. I just want to do something quick, not to, not to waste much of your time. Let's... frequency and for this let's give it a bit of a reverb reverb let's use the, the fruity reverb let's use the drum room for the drum room uh, okay this is a rim shot let's set chain it here reduce the velocity a bit then let's let's take a bit of a, a low frequencies yeah something to get it right the saturation knob let's add a bit of saturation to it take it low lift this up a bit and get the velocity down yeah this is it and finally for our beat let's do something on the master channel let's use the fruity law filter the preset nah, not this let's use the low pass filter and for this create automation clip okay this way this is it That's it. So for, don't forget to like, subscribe, and drop your comments. Thank you.